What if, right now, someone close to you is fighting a battle you know nothing about? Mental health is as integral to our well-being as physical health, yet it's often hidden, misunderstood, or simply ignored. It's a topic that touches all of us directly or indirectly, and yet it is often shrouded in silence. This silence, however, doesn't make it any less real or important. In fact, it's estimated that nearly one in five adults lives with a mental illness. That's a significant part of our society, isn't it? Today, we aim to break this silence. We're here to shine a light on mental health, to discuss it openly, and to understand it better. We'll delve into some of the most common mental health disorders. We'll explore their symptoms and signs and help you understand how they can manifest in everyday life. But it's not just about understanding these disorders. It's about dispelling myths and misconceptions, too. Mental health is often surrounded by a cloud of misunderstanding and stigma, which can make it even more difficult for those affected to seek the help they need. We'll tackle these misconceptions head-on and reveal the reality of living with a mental health disorder. Of course, understanding and awareness are only the first steps. It's crucial to know how to seek help for yourself or for others, and to understand that there is hope. There are countless stories of recovery, of individuals reclaiming their lives from the clutches of mental illness. We'll share some of these inspiring journeys with you, to show that while the path may be difficult, recovery is indeed possible. Our goal is not just to inform, but to inspire action, to encourage dialogue, and to foster understanding and empathy. Because mental health, like physical health, should never be ignored or stigmatized. It should be acknowledged, understood, and treated with compassion and care. Together, we can unmask the unseen and often misunderstood world of mental health. Mental health disorders are more common than you might think. They come in many forms, each with their unique characteristics but all having the potential to disrupt life as we know it. Let's start with depression. This is more than just feeling down or having a bad day. It's a persistent feeling of sadness, loss of interest, and a lack of energy that lasts for two weeks or more. Depression can make the simplest tasks feel like monumental challenges. Next is anxiety disorders. These are characterized by excessive fear or anxiety that can manifest in several ways, such as panic attacks, phobias, or social anxiety. If left unchecked, anxiety disorders can greatly limit a person's ability to function in daily life. Then we have bipolar disorder, formerly known as manic depression. This condition causes extreme mood swings that include emotional highs or mania and lows or depression. These mood swings can affect sleep, energy, activity, judgment, behavior, and the ability to think clearly. Schizophrenia, on the other hand, is a serious mental disorder where people interpret reality abnormally. It can result in some combination of hallucinations, delusions, and extremely disordered thinking and behavior that impairs daily functioning and can be disabling. Finally, we have post-traumatic stress disorder, or PTSD. This disorder can develop after a person has experienced or witnessed a terrifying event. Symptoms may include flashbacks, nightmares, severe anxiety, and uncontrollable thoughts about the event. These disorders, while distinct, share a common thread they affect our mental well-being and require attention. It's important to remember that having a mental health disorder is not a sign of weakness or a character flaw. It's just a part of the human condition, and like any other health issue, it's something that can be managed with the right help and support. And remember, there's no shame in seeking help. After all, 
Mental health is just as important as physical health. Before we continue, remember to hit that subscribe button. By subscribing, you'll join our community of like-minded individuals. Together, we can achieve success and wealth as we learn, grow, and support each other. Click subscribe now and let's dive back into today's topic. Recognizing the signs is the first step towards helping. Just as physical ailments have symptoms, so do mental health disorders. They give us cues, signals that something isn't quite right. While these signs can be subtle, they are often noticeable if we take the time to observe. One of the most common symptoms of mental health disorders is a significant change in mood. This could be persistent feelings of sadness, anxiety, or emptiness. It could also look like excessive highs and lows, sudden shifts from being extremely happy to incredibly sad without any apparent reason. Behavioral changes are another signpost. Perhaps there's a sudden disinterest in activities once loved or an unexplained drop in performance at work or school. Changes could also be seen in personal care, like neglecting hygiene or appearance. Then there's the shift in thinking patterns. This could manifest as constant worry, racing thoughts or difficulties in concentration and decision-making. In more severe cases, it could mean experiencing delusions or hallucinations. Let's get a bit more specific. If we circle back to the disorders we discussed earlier, each has its unique symptoms. For instance, someone struggling with depression might experience a loss of energy, changes in appetite, or feelings of worthlessness. Someone with anxiety disorder might have an intense, excessive, and persistent worry and fear about everyday situations. A person with bipolar disorder may experience episodes of mood swings ranging from depressive lows to manic highs. Remember, these symptoms can vary greatly from person to person. They may also fluctuate over time, making it even more challenging to recognize. But here's the thing. Understanding these signs is not about becoming an overnight psychologist. It's about being aware. Being able to notice when a loved one, or even oneself, is showing these signs. It's about knowing when it's more than just a bad day. Understanding these signs can be the key to recognizing when someone might need help. It's about starting the conversation about mental health, breaking down. The stigma and moving towards a place of understanding and support. It's time to separate fact from fiction. In the realm of mental health, misconceptions abound, obscuring the truth and perpetuating stigma. It's high time we address these misunderstandings head-on, with the clarity of facts and the power of knowledge. One widely held misconception is that mental health disorders are a sign of weakness. This couldn't be further from the truth. Mental health disorders are not reflective of a person's character, strength, or resilience. They're health conditions, much like diabetes or asthma. They're not the result of personal flaws or failures. They're the result of complex interplays between genetic, biological, environmental, and psychological factors. Another common fallacy is that mental health disorders are rare. This is a gross understatement. In reality, mental health issues are more common than we think. One in four people worldwide will be affected by mental or neurological disorders at some point in their lives. That's about two billion people, or nearly the entire population of China and India combined. Then, there's the belief that people with mental health issues are unpredictable, dangerous, or violent. The truth is, individuals with mental health disorders are more likely to be victims of violence rather than perpetrators. They're not inherently violent. They're just battling an unseen enemy. 
There's also the misconception that people with mental disorders cannot function or contribute to society. This is a damaging stereotype. Many individuals with mental health issues lead fulfilling lives, work successfully, and make significant contributions to their communities. Mental health disorders do not define a person's potential or worth. Lastly, the myth that children don't experience mental health problems. This is a dangerous belief. Mental health disorders can and do affect people of all ages. Early intervention and treatment can make a significant difference in a child's life. By dispelling these myths, we make way for understanding and empathy. Because once we peel away the layers of misconception, we can see mental health disorders for what they truly are health conditions that deserve compassion, understanding, and appropriate care. Help is available. Recovery is possible. This is a truth worth repeating and believing. You're not alone in this journey. There are numerous avenues of help available to you. Firstly, therapy is a great place to start. Mental health professionals, such as psychologists, psychiatrists, and counselors, are trained to guide you through your journey. They can provide you with coping mechanisms, strategies to navigate your day-to-day -day life, and a safe space to express your feelings and thoughts. Medication is another option. Psychiatric medications are designed to regulate brain chemistry and help alleviate symptoms. It's important to remember that these medications are not a quick fix. They are tools to help manage your disorder. Always consult with a healthcare professional to determine if this is the right course for you. Support groups are another powerful resource. These groups can provide a sense of community and understanding. It's comforting to know that there are others who are going through similar situations. And their experiences and insights can be invaluable. Now, let's take a moment to share some stories of recovery. There's John, who battled severe depression for many years. He sought help engaged in regular therapy, and started medication. Today, he's thriving, leading a fulfilling life, and even mentoring others going through the same struggle. Then there's Sarah, who struggled with anxiety. She found solace in a support group and learned various coping mechanisms. Today, she's not just managing her anxiety, but she's also using her experience to help others giving talks about mental health awareness in her community. These are just two examples among countless stories of recovery. Each one is unique. Each one is inspiring. They remind us that even in the darkest times, there's always a glimmer of hope. Remember, mental health disorders are not a life sentence. With the right help and support, recovery is within reach. So. Don't hesitate to seek help. You're worth it, and your journey to recovery is only just beginning. So, what's the takeaway? Well, we've journeyed through the realm of mental health, exploring common disorders, their signs and symptoms. We've debunked misconceptions and highlighted the stark reality. Importantly, we've emphasized that seeking help is not a sign of weakness but strength. And we've heard inspiring stories of recovery that remind us that hope is never lost. Remember, mental health matters. Let's unmask it, understand it, and support those who are fighting the unseen battles. Thanks for watching. Embrace the shadows, hit subscribe, and stay tuned for our next video. Until then, harness the darkness and forge your path to greatness.